Hey guys, Booligan Airsoft Retreat, BooliganAirsoft.com and Airsoft Insider Magazine. Um, today we are taking a very quick look before we install it at the Madball Umbrella Corps, uh, the UCWRG, Umbrella Corps Weapon Research Group, uh, Grip 23. Now, as you may recall, I've got the real Umbrella Corps Grip 23 on my AR pistol. The reasons I went with it, I love the texture on it. Um, I love the more pronounced grip angle, which is very beneficial if you're using something with a very short length of pull or a pistol like I have. Um, and I like that it's made by Umbrella Core and this company is actually ballsy enough to throw Umbrella Core on their product. Not sure how uh, the video game company feels about that, but that's not my problem. What is my problem? Not necessarily my problem. So we picked up this from Jag Precision, the Mad Bull Airsoft version of the Umbrella Core AR M4 Pistol Grip 23. Um, and I wasn't really sure what to expect. I know that it'd be pretty similar in look, pretty similar in feel. I knew that they would have to straighten out the grip. The problem with AEGs, because this is an AEG grip, it's a motor grip. Um, you've got a gearbox in here, and the motor has to sit at a certain way, at a certain angle, in order to properly function. And this would not work. This nearly vertical grip angle would not work. So they had to add a little bit more angle to it. As you can see, they added a lot of it more angle to it, a whole lot. Um, this is actually an identical grip angle to a standard um, A2 grip that you would have on an M4A1 or an M16. So, yeah, I mean, it is what it is. I really wish that there was some way to have it a little bit more straight, but Given the limitations that we have with motor engagement angles and things like that, I absolutely understand why Mad Bull went the way that they went. Um, and they did what, I mean, what they could. The material itself is pretty much identical. You have the same texture. You have the same, mar the exact same markings everywhere. It's identical. You even have the same kind of not that great seam lines on the back. Um, the same extended back strap here. Just that grip angle is different. So... Um, like I said, it's understandable. Um, I understand why they had to do it, but it, it kind of is the nature of the beast when it comes to uh, building um, M4 AEGs. So uh, we will install this on that VFC VR16 pretty soon um, once we do the full review of it. I can't muck it up too much with custom parts until uh, obviously I am able to uh, do a full review on it. So uh, keep an eye on the channel and on the website, Airsoft Retreat, BooleanAirsoft.com. And we will have that uh, review posted uh, shortly. Uh, many thanks for watching. And uh, be sure to watch all of the videos on the channel. If you have any, any questions on anything, if you have any requests for videos, please let us know. Um, you can message us or you can message us on the Facebook page and we uh, will be able to answer your questions. And if you have an idea for a review or a project that you'd like to see, let us know.